A motor control, again, every single component, if you listen to it, it'll tell you what it is. It controls motors. It um, protects a motor. There's a motor starter. Motor, if I can't spell. So there's a starter. Let's call it starter. There's, and there's multiple things, but you know, we'll get into more detail on this. But typically, to, to, to you know, start the motor and control it, there's push button controls, turn it on and off, and slow it down, speed it up. Think about your motor in the car, the controls in your car. Electrical world, electronic, industrial world, it's not that much different. There, you start your car, you use your brakes to slow it down, there's a protection in your car to protect the motor. It's the same thing in industrial. It's a little bit differently, but it's kind of the basics are, are not a lot different than the concept of a motor in your car. Power supply is the only liar on our, on our line card. They do not supply power. Everything else tells you what it is. They're a liar. Power supplies do not supply power. They really should be called a converter, a changer. Converter, is it OR? Here's what, a, here's what a power supply does, and they're very common. Here's what a power supply does. It changes AC power to DC power. And actually, true AC power is not clean. That's why there's surge, surge suppressors, circuit breakers, and fuses. Real AC power looks like this. It's really inaccurate. And that's why we have so many protective devices on all of our electronic equipment because we're not getting a clean, clean power source coming in. So what does, a D, what does a power supply do? A power supply changes AC to DC power. So it takes the AC power, and you, you put a power supply in the panel or on the printed circuit board, and it changes it to DC power. You can obviously see the benefit of this. The benefit of this is clean power that doesn't cause as many spikes and problems, but you, you can keep, you don't have to recharge it. You don't have to pull this out like, like a, a flashlight or a camera and recharge it all the time. It's unendless. It, it will run forever as long as the, the, you know, the utility is working. So a power supply just simply changes it from AC to DC power. So many people, many, many people change it to DC power because there's a big advantage. The big advantage is it's a really clean source for medical and high tech and, and really, you know, most of our laptops have a power supply on the, on the, where you plug it in because they're actually changing AC to DC power on your laptop. So, you know, again, that's the only one. Every other thing in our line card tells you what it is. 